Hello everyone, I'm your host Boss Zombie. Welcome back to the Batman Tells Hill series, City of Light. What'd you pick up, Brucey? Oh, that's sad. Hey, news guy. I owe you so much. You're a hero. And I'm gonna make sure all of Gotham knows it. Hey, you spun you around quick. Okay, you did not need to shoot that man. Lady Arkham has it forgotten. Oh, he's not dead. Wow. Everything you love will burn. Most of the things I love have burned already. This house, my friend. Parts of me when I got electrocuted. Oh, and here's the intro. An episode later. How could someone get burned like Harvey did and not die from it, though? God, like... He had a lamp explode on his face. Ooh. Your usual tea and the entire pantry, I'm afraid, didn't survive the fire. This is from my own personal supply. You have a personal supply? Thanks, Alfred. A lot of sugar. We're not the only ones that took a hit while Mayor Dent was in power. Well, at least you've ensured Harvey won't be hurting anyone else. Bruce, these last few weeks... I worry about the toll they've taken on you. Facing off against Harvey and Oswald in a matter of days. N not just the physical toll. Those were men you once trusted. And after finding out what you did about your father, people must seem a great disappointment to you. Nah. Always letting you, you can down. always make new friends. Even those whom you admire. That's just part of life, bro. Not everyone is like my father or Oswald. And what Harvey became, it wasn't by choice. And me. You're the best person in the world, Alfred. Everything that happened, I could have stopped it. Oh, well, Alfred. If I'd done something all those years ago. But this, this is my fault. All of it. I told you I wanted to leave your father's employ. But if only I had the guts to do something instead. Yeah, then he would have left me your mother with no one to she raise wanted me. Wanted that. Wanted to put an end to his crimes. If I'd helped her. If I'd stopped Thomas. None of these horrors would have occurred. Lady Arkham. Oswald. Even Harvey. I don't blame you for what happened, Alfred. You did the best you could in an impossible situation. And it helped to make me the man I am today. I... It's okay to cry. You, Grown men can cry, Alfred. It's all right. But our work isn't done. The children of Arkham are still out there. And Lady Arkham. With both Penguin and Mayor Dent off the board, she's the only remaining piece. We need to figure out her next I feel like we're forgetting someone the else. Thing we do know is that no, they're all dead. From a Never mind. To poison the city. With Penguin gone and my CEO access restored, we'll finally log into Wade Enterprises. Wait, your CEO just like that? Exactly what Oswald was doing during his time in charge. God, companies move fast. Let's reference that with all the data we have on Vicky Vale. We might be able to figure out the children of Arkham's next move. Oh, this. Wait. Oh, right stick. Oh, I don't need to look at the codex and shit. All right, let's look at the... Your administrative access to Wayne Enterprises should have been reinstated by now, along with your title of CEO. Let's see what Oswald was doing while he sat in my chair. See, this would be a funny thing you see on, like, Wikipedia. It would say, CEO Bruce Master Wayne, Cobblepot, sense of Cobblepot hasn't changed much like, a week, <laughs> and then Bruce Wayne again. Let's see what he was doing. He put penguins on his folders? Really? Penguin was tapping into surveillance systems across Gotham. Any building using Wayne Tech security could be spied on from the CEO's office. So basically, any How building. Is that any different 
and the back door into the Wayne network that he uncovered. That's nine. Unless... Hold on. Well, I could look at security when I see the rest of this first. I was trying to buy an island. What on earth for? Looks like he was using his new legal control of Carmine Falcone's assets and likeness to brand the place. It's some kind of tourist attraction. He was going to call it Falcone Island. I don't get it. Figure out Lady Arkham's next move. Of course. Oh, Oswald certainly wasn't very frugal with my money. You have a few yachts to return, it appears. Also explains how the children of Arkham had a seemingly endless supply of guns. Oswald was using Wayne money to arm them. Oh boy. Oswald altered several public records using the Wayne network. Oh, that's entirely illegal. You shouldn't have access for that. Oswald manipulated my records as well. It would appear your degree was in sociology. And my medical records. There are some, well, but colorful diseases. Annoying, but not hard to fix. Ah, oh, <laughs> that's better. Did you just have like a backup on your computer? Well, no surprise here, Oswald wiped away any trace of his criminal records. His background is completely fabricated. He was enrolled at Cambridge? Ridiculous. <laughs> Calm down, Alfred. I'm sure the board realizes by now that they were fooled. Hmm. All mention of her birth name, Victoria Arkham, is completely gone. Wait, wait, wait. What's this? He also erased something from Vicky's research at the Gazette. I can't tell what was removed from here, but Wayne Tech leaves a trace when it alters data. Uh -oh. One the bad computer can decode. What is it Miss Vale wanted to hide? Wait, I'm not gonna... Can I... Can I scroll down? No? Oh, this is the same. I can't... Is Are we really not gonna talk... What do we have here? They did more than just look at these schematics. Every building in Gotham with a Wayne Tech security system can be accessed from here and remotely controlled. If Oswald was the brawn, Vicky is the brains. So I thought her Oswald phone. seemed pretty smart she too. She may have left clues about what she was using Oswald's access for. Oh. Reported for the Gotham Gazette, and not in the public record. Her true name, Victoria Arkham. To think she was here, in the manor. She gave nothing away of her true nature then. Oh, we got lots of stuff. Vicky embraced this identity to follow through on her twisted crusade. Her mask inspires fear. Not unlike Batman. Hers is a little creepier than I Batman's. I just need to find her. The children of Arkham. Their symbol dates back much farther than their terrorist activity. They formed to give justice for those wronged at Arkham Asylum. But the message fell on deaf ears. Until they found a leader Gotham couldn't ignore. The Gazette's records of the articles written by Vicki Vale. This record isn't complete. You're right. There are notable gaps between entries. But yet, it doesn't seem she ever left the Gazette's employ. So what was she doing in that time? This record wouldn't be easy to alter. Seeing what Oswald was up to could give us a fresh perspective. 
We're just oh, unlock. Now that we know how Oswald manipulated Vicky's records, oh, the back okay. computer should be able to. There, no more holes. Oh. She was looking into Arkham patients, reviewing records, checking submissions, prior histories. She was trying to figure out who was actually sick and who was committed because of Hill, Falcone, and my father. Vicky was digging deep. Gotham City records, freedom of information requests, post to conspiracy forums. All to find. It's a list. Gotham buildings that use Wayne Tech security systems. It's a list of targets. City Hall, Arkham Asylum, GCPD headquarters, Gotham First National. It's almost every landmark in the city. We're on to something. Vicky wants to bypass the security at a Gotham landmark. Oh. Okay, part two already. Man inside hmm. Wayne Enterprises. She can't unlock that door remotely. She'll have to get her hands dirty. And when she does, we'll find her. Speaking of, is it Lady Arkham? No, it's one of Lucius's prototypes on the move. What? Oh. But Lucius locked everything away. Well, he needed a better lock. She stole from you? After we opened our doors to her. She probably had good intentions. All that you two, Alfred. Yeah, I know, Bruce, but why would she do this? She's trying Is to she help. That cold hearted? No. That selfish? Oh, God, be quiet, Alfred. She must have her reasons. Well, I'm sure she does. Computer visual. The prototype she stole. It's an electronic skeleton key. With it, you could bypass any security system made by Wayne Tech. That key is far too dangerous in Miss Kyle's hands, especially with Lady Arkham still at large. Get the car ready, Alfred. Huh? And Alfred, let Lucius know what's happening. I'm going to get some answers from Selina. Alfred didn't have to get shit ready. This car was ready and waiting. Trying to hey, skip Bruce. town with a new toy? I wasn't expecting you. Thought I'd make it outside the city limits at least. Clearly my ride needs a tune-up. If you wanted to see me, you could have just called. <laughs> the chase is so much more fun. But I know you're not here for me. Are you? I don't blame you for wanting it back. How did you get it in the first place? I'm surprised you had a toy like this. No doubt Batman would use it for the good of Gotham, but the less noble options are so much more exciting. Why have Why you become sinister lately? So much potential. Just imagine what I'd be able to dig my claws into. Thief of your class doesn't need a device like that. It'd only be a crutch. <laughs> Says the man whose belt is an armory. Catch. I know you're just playing into my pride. But you're right. I don't need a crutch. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't pretend you're not impressed. As long cons go, this one was a beauty. Getting into Wayne Tech's lab took a lot more than cracking a safe. I had to get close to people. Your friend Harvey. Poor guy just wanted to fall in love so bad. After that, it didn't take very long to get my introduction to his BFF. <laughs> the great Bruce. I feel like she's putting some of this on as an act. Imagine my surprise when the rich playboy turned out to be Batman. Scourge of Gotham. I was always going to steal from Bruce Wayne. I just never expected he'd be so interesting. As a mark, that is. 
You talk a good game, but I don't buy it for a second. You're not that shallow. You really think you know me that well? I know that whatever this started as, that's not all it means to you now. The only thing it means is that I'm very good at my job. That's not a job. I'm getting you can't out report here. that to your taxes. That's not a God job. God a house on fire, and I'm not going to burn with it. If you were smart, you'd get out of here too. This town hates you. Hates your entire family. Just leave it all behind. Do something more meaningful with those skills of yours. I owe it to the people. Don't need the money, but but think of the fun. Someday, yeah. Maybe I will be able to leave Gotham. But for now, I am the only one who can save this city. So humble. It'll be good to put some distance between us. After all, look at what happened to Harvey. It'd only be a matter of time before I crossed one of your lines. Isn't that right? My copy of the Boy Scout Handbook is out of date. I'm bound to break some rule. Selena, I would never hurt you. Bruce, I... Isn't that what really Harvey sweet. said? But it brings us to the root of our problem, doesn't it? You're upset that I'm leaving. What'd you think? That one night of sex meant we were going steady? Mm. Is that what you really thought? I had fun, Selena. Mm. Didn't you? I'm all for fun, Bruce. But how long does this stay fun before you start wanting more? <sighs> ah, Look, she has Bruce, commitment problems. I'll admit that what you and I had, it wasn't terrible. But you were just another job. A more intriguing job than I was expecting. But still a job. And that job's done. Did a trumpet just, I'm done just like, join in for a second? It's not complicated. I'm not a good person. I'm certainly no hero, and I don't want to be. I'm a thief. That's all I am. All right, all right. You're putting yourself down, but you're you not a bad mistake. person. I never pretended to be anything else. Stop. It's not true. I know there's more to you than that. You're just afraid to admit it. You'd like it if that were true, wouldn't you? Why would you even think that? You I saved my ass, didn't really you? Clear. Why aren't you listening? She saved his butt like twice, didn't she? Wait. You saved my life. You could have left me to die back in that warehouse. No, I think it was like twice. Someone who's only out for herself, who's just a thief, wouldn't do that. Oh yeah? Who would? A good person. That's who. A hero. You know, after I found out you were Batman, I thought nothing else could surprise me, but you just keep on surprising me. Oh, is she gonna blow you away with this one too? Just like the first time? Oh. And now she's gonna steal the key and run away. Something to remember me by. <laughs> I won't need any help remembering you. Ooh. Well, it's been fun. I was gonna search his pockets, the key's gonna be gone. Bye, Selena. Bye, Bats. She snagged the key when she was kissing you goodbye. Lucius, I've got the key. Do you? Uh, hold on, Alfred's on the line. Hey, Alfred, I... Bruce! Lady Arkham! She's here! Oh. I, I tried to keep them out, but... Uh -oh. Alfred? Uh-oh. Alfred! Uh-oh. Let's find out what happens in the next episode, so... Thanks for joining me. Come back out the next episode real soon, but until then... Bye.